Hi kids, today we're going to learn about bacteria and archaea by reading a real science for kids book by Rebecca Woodbury, PhD. Have you wondered what might live in really hot places? I wonder what could live in there. Oh, the little mouse asks, something lives in there? Have you wondered what might live in really smelly places? I wonder what lives in there. The little mouse says, I would not live there. Did you know your gut is home to millions of tiny organisms? Little mouse asks, does my stomach look like that? Some of the tiniest organisms on the planet are bacteria and archaea. They are so tiny that you cannot see them with only your eyes. Are they smaller than I am? asked the little mouse. Definitely. Bacteria and archaea look a lot alike. In the past, scientists put bacteria and archaea in the same group. Today, Scientists know that they are different from each other. Hmm, the little mouse says they look the same to me. An archaea at the top. I think I am different. And then you see three bacteria at the bottom. We like dirt. Bacteria have three basic shapes. Rods, spheres, and spirals. Rod-shaped bacteria look like short hot dogs. Sphere-shaped bacteria look like tiny ping-pong balls. Spiral-shaped bacteria look like wiggly snakes. Bacteria can live in many different places. I can live in different places. Can you? asks the mouse. Some bacteria live in dirt. We live in dirt. Some bacteria live in water. We like water. Splish, splash. Some bacteria live alone, and some bacteria live in a big group called a colony. Like bacteria, archaea also have different shapes. Some archaea look like a ball with lots of squiggly hairs on one side. Some archaea look like lumpy ping pong balls. Some archaea are rod shaped. Some archaea form long hair like shapes. Archaea can be found in very hot and very salty places. Hey, we need more salt! Some archaea even eat iron. Ow! Archaea and bacteria are amazing, says the little mouse. How to say science words. Here's a key to help you pronounce all these different words. Archaea, bacteria, colony, organism, rod, sphere, spiral. I hope you had fun learning about bacteria and archaea. What questions do you have about bacteria and archaea? Ask your teacher, your parents, and do some of your own research. Keep on learning. You can check out more books like these at Real Science for Kids. I enjoy these books and use them with my own kids. The end. And if you liked this video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe.